Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome to another video on Vinny. Our Vivaro. If you want to help the channel grow, please give us a thumbs up and consider subscribing. Um, it's free, only takes a second to click, and you'll be able to see what else we do. Hello. Oh my god, what that big nose. You can say hello, dude. Hey, what are you doing in my workshop? You're not allowed in here. Bye bye. So the problem I've had with the Vararo, or one of the many problems we've had with the Vararo since we've had it, is when you unlock it, fine. Not fine. So I'm going to dig in and have a look. Why is this so difficult? Ugh. Had a quick look in here and they're pretty clean. They, if you do look, let's see they're scuffed. So, and this door needs adjusting and also you can see there it's been dragging up. So I have got to adjust the door. But what I noticed on the other side is that that one's in. Those are stuck out more. Can you see that? What if we do that? See? Those two are stuck out a lot more. So I'm going to actually start looking at this side, and I think it's just a little plastic T something size there. So I'll whip that out. We'll have a look. We've got a little T30 clip here, which doesn't appear to... Oh, it does undone. But it's really loose, so don't press on it when you undo it, and it might pop out. Or will it not pop Oh. Ah, there we go, one of those soap clips. Pop it out. <laughs> right. So, I think you can see the reason why this ain't working. Um, yeah. They're supposed to be in like that. <sighs> well, at least it's, we found it. I think I might test it make sure the motor works as well though same sort of clip on this one just don't press it and it does sort of come out weird ones these not used to this sort of clip on Volkswagens but I'm guessing it just pulls out there ah, so we got that must be for the interior light switch that's not doing a thing um, and then there's our three wires yellow red and white same as on that side so i reckon if i link those up with a test wire we'd be able to check see if the motor's working all i got here is a test wire linking the same colors so we got white to blue blue to white red to brown brown to red and yellow to green and yellow green and yellow to yellow and we'll see if that works but what i am going to do I don't know if it makes any difference on this at all, but I'm going to just pretend to lock the door. We are unlocked. Yes! Nice one. Do it again, and then unlock. We have got central locking on that, so that's working. Just need to get a wire that does that. I've been having a look at this, and... I don't think that I'm going to be able to reliably solder these back together. Um, so I think I'm going to have a look online, see if I can get a replacement. And pop this one back in, just do that, get it hooked in at the bottom, push it down, get the little thing you do for. Job done. Well, we're back, and I've got a bit. Now, this was a bit more than I wanted to spend, really. It was £32.90. Uh, it's brand new. Um, I'll put a link in below where I got it from. But there's uh, the part numbers that you might need. Uh, just open it up. But I was looking online, you know, on eBay and things like that, secondhand, and they were sort of, I think... 
about 15, 20 pounds. And I thought, well, if that's happened to that one, you know, it could be imminent that it's, it's going to happen to them. Look, that's nice enough. So anyway, we've got a brand new part. Even comes with a new screw. Hope you can see this all right. I've got a light pointing at me. Let's adjust that. And a girt long wire with a, a pluggy plug on. So I guess we've got to take the interior panel off of this and thread it through. I've never took one off, so let's find out together how it comes off. Well, we are in the van shut in, so I do apologise about the sound and if you can see stuff or not. I think we better start off with this one. Take that off, which is a T30 and, and it loose. So that should be easy. That's just, I'm sorry if I'm in the way. I'm, I'm rubbish at this filming malarkey. One day I might get used to it, but there again, I doubt it. And then this thing, I think, must just pull off. I've got a few sort of lever tools and things, and I'm hoping this pulls off. I don't really know. Looks like it should. Oh, oh, that was easy. That was easy. And then I'd imagine these just pop off. Looks like it. Always good to have some plastic trim tools. These were cheap as chips from eBay. I bought them years ago. I doubt they're still there, but worth it. Definitely worth getting the right trim tool if you can. Ah, there we go. It's off. So where's the wires we need? I don't know. Got a big lump of foam there. Um, it goes all the way along. Must be that one. Yeah. All right, I'll just grab you a sec and hopefully we can see what's inside. So this wire is up in there. Can you see it? I'm sorry if you can't. It's that one up there. Now I've got to try and get a screwdriver on it. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it either there. And pop the plug off the top. Now I do apologise if you cannot see anything. I can't see much either. I reckon it should be on top. Does that look like it moved? That's it. Alright, I think I'll just unthread the clips out of this one. Um, I can open the door now. Uh, how can I open the door? I'll put the handle on briefly and then feed it back. See, I don't know. I'll turn it a bit. That I reckon looks like it. Oops, sorry, torch. Let's get this Put the new one in. there was it? I can't remember. I know one was underneath. It's that one there. Let's pop that in. That must be there. Pop that in there. Try not to squish me torch. Um, that one goes like that. 
that one in and then we've got to plug it in uh, you saw where this was before didn't you that's it that is it right What do you reckon? Should we try it? Let's try it. Let's see. That moves. Yes! Result! So I've just given it a clean up and I've put a little bit of sound deadening on it to try and quieten it down a little bit. There's time to put this cover box. That's mucky. Let's put the interior trim back on. I do get diverted, don't I, in crumbs. Um, just line them up, I suppose, and pop them off. Oh, or not. Let's try again, shall we? That one's gone in. Just a bit fiddly, I think. That's because it's in there. Firm. Let's push that one on. Then the handle. And the little screw. I'm presuming there should be a little cover for this, but do not possess that on this oh! on this bar. Nip! Right, so we open and shut. Where's the remote? Let's see if we're still working. Lock! On lock! Yes, nice. So short of a getting re grubby finger marks up there everything I reckon we're done well I'm pleased with that it actually works right guys well thank you so much for watching I hope this is of some use to you if you've got the same problem I mean you might be able to repair it by soldering those little tabs back on but they just don't seem to be enough meat on them to, but it might work, might work for a bit, but I thought I wanted the reliability of it, so I spent the 32 quid. Anyway, again, thank you very much for watching. Uh, if you'd like to see other stuff we've got going, please subscribe. Please give us a thumbs up, it helps the channel enormously, and I hope to see you next time. Cheers then! Well guys, I'm pleased with that. That actually works. <laughs> but it didn't. I've broken it already. <laughs> it actually works. Occasionally. <laughs>